Hi, I'm Jill and I work for Dawn Bibbit at her design studio. Today I'm going to show you some of our brand new Christmas acrylic stamps which have just come in and are really pretty and very useful to work with. Okay, The first one is um, one with a lovely Noel and various other baubles and snowflakes. A more funky design with a couple of snowmen. Of course everybody needs uh, words for the bottom of the card so we've got one that has loads of different words and phrases. A more traditional sort of one with an odd cutie on the bottom and then this one which is I think is everybody's favourite the one with the Father Christmas on. This as some people will remember was very popular a couple of years back um, when it was as a wooden block but now we've managed to get it as an acrylic stamp and then last but not least the one with the three wise men and a smaller version of the Father Christmas and this is the one I'm going to demonstrate for you today. So taking a piece of white card and the acrylic stamp which I've placed onto an acrylic block I'm going to ink this up with black stays on because placing it on the table flat and with very light even taps just to give, get an even coverage of black and I'm now going to place it and stamp onto a piece of white card which I've previously cut to the right size always keep one hand on your stamp and to give it even pressure all the way around. If you take that off, as you can see, we've got a lovely clear image that um, has come from using the stamp. I'm just going to pop that to one side just to let it dry before we do the next stage. While that's drying, if we take a piece of this brand new black gloss card with a beautiful holographic silver foiling on it, um, this is going to be the background of our card and I'm, all I'm going to simply do is take it, fold it in half and with my bone folder you simply put a sharp crease into it so there we've got the background for our card okay I've also put two pieces a piece of silver mirror and a piece of black gloss card which I'm now going to put into the center of my um, backing card so that we can then be ready for when we've done it I've put 3d foam on the back and all we need to do is just take the little squares off the top and place that into the centre of the card okay and with the black gloss I've simply put some double sided tape which I'm going to remove the easy lift tape all these products obviously are available from Dawn Bibby's Design Studio and if we just place that on the top we've now got our backing ready for the card okay I'll just pop that to one side and we'll go back to the stamped image what I'm going to do now is take a Versamark ink pad and simply cover the whole image with Versamark before I apply a kaleidoscope embossing powder. Okay. This again is available on the website. Um, so all we need to do is just scatter the embossing powder all over the image that we've done and tap off the excess of that okay I'll leave that to one side we can pop that back in the bag a little bit later and then taking my heat gun I'm going to now heat the image so that the embossing powder melts and gives us a, a glittery background
as you can see we've now got a glittery image with the kaleidoscope the more I heat it the more it changes the colour so if we take our original card now and get ready to put this onto the mats and layers that we've placed on the card I'm just taking some easy lift tape which again is very easy to use and we take the backing of the card down make sure we've got the card the right way up and pop that into the middle okay so we've got that there the last thing to do is to take the um, word thing and cut two strips just with the Merry Christmas on it I've put backing foil that backing tape on the back there and I'm just going to place that across the top Oops. and one across the bottom trim those edges off and there you can see we've got a really pretty card just to give you some more examples of cards that you can make using the products that I've shown you there's the a replica of the one we've just made there's one using one of the bauble stamps um, there's one using the little wreath where we've just glittered it and put um, diamantes on it and then the one with the everybody's favourite the little father Christmas and one of the other holographic stamps I'd like to thank you for watching this clip and hope that you enjoy making cards like we do thank you